Hi Warriors! Here's a quick video on how to transfer content from one class to another in Schoology. So since the Dazzle courses got populated, a lot of you have been asking me how you can take a class you created this summer and move the whole thing over to the new class. So let's take a look at how we're going to do that. First you're going to start with the class that has all the content built out and you're going to open it up. And what I want to do is take all this content exactly in this order and move it to my new class. So rather than have to do each folder separately, I'm actually just going to go to Options, Save Course to Resources. So this is going to take the whole thing, package it in one folder, and it's going to move it to this file cabinet in the, in the sky called Resources. So it's going to say Save Course to Resources. This is your organization system, so they have collection level and then folder level. So if you've created them, you can choose a collection or a subfolder. If you leave it at the default, I'm going to show you now where that's going to go. So you'll click Submit. It'll take it a few minutes depending on the size of your class. Then you're going to come up here to Resources, the file cabinet in the sky, and find your folder. So the default is your personal resources and your collections are over here. So if you've created multiple, you'll see them here. You can create additional collections by clicking on this button if you want to start organizing your life. Uh, if you chose the default, which is home, it's going to open up home automatically. And the newest content will be toward the bottom. So you're going to look for that folder that has the same name as the course you just exported. So mine was this, this class right here. This part throws people off because from this point you can click a drop down arrow and say add to course. If you do this though, what you're moving is this whole folder into the new course, but the folder won't be automatically opened, so you'll just have one folder full of stuff imported into the new class, if that makes sense. So instead, I actually want to open the folder and I want all of it looking like this in the new course. So I opened it. I'm going to choose this checkbox here that automatically selects everything. And I'm going to choose the edit drop down menu and then choose add to course from this screen. If I do it from this screen, then it's going to keep everything just like this. Um, so now I just have to pick which course I want to put it in. Let's just say this one for demonstration purposes, and you're going to import. If it's a lot of stuff like mine, uh, it's going to take it a while, and you can click on the transfer history to see what the progress is. But when you're done, you're going to go to Courses, you'll open up your class, and it's going to look like this. So they'll have moved everything over in the exact order that you wanted it. So just to recap very quickly, you're going to start by going to Courses, Select the course that has the content, choose Options, Save Course to Resources, choose which folders you want to put it in, and then head over to Resources to find that folder. Pop open the folder, select all, edit, add to course. Choose which course to move it to, and you're all set. As always, if you have any questions about Schoology or anything tech related, don't hesitate to reach out to your digital learning coach today.